Next, we'll look at Sigamidex. Sigamidex is a reversal agent for the monoquaternary amino steroids, so it only works to reverse blockade by rocuronium or vecuronium. It won't have any effect on paralysis by any other agent. It has a gamma cyclodextrin ring that binds the rocuronium and vacuronium, completely deactivating them within three minutes. The dose will depend on the level of the block. If you need immediate reversal of rock or vec that you've only just administered, you're going to need 16 milligrams per kilo of Sigamidex. So you'll likely need several ampules because each two mil ampule of Sigamidex only contains 200 milligrams. If the patient has two twitches on a train of four, you only need to administer two milligrams per kilogram. But if you have a more profound block with a post tetanic count of only one, to one or two, you'll need four to eight milligrams per kilo. This elimination is renal and has a half-life of two hours. You may notice a slight bradycardia on administration of Sigamidex. Interestingly, it reduces the body's progesterone exposure, so women of childbearing age should be advised to follow the missed pill rules if they're using a progesterone-containing contraceptive, and it can also cause a transiently prolonged PT and APTT.